Hello, this is Spellbinder reporting on something I saw. It's kind of unusual. It starts down here off of Florida, and you'll see very clearly that there's something. I don't know what this is. Clouds going against the flow of the jet stream. Look at look at, right in this area, right here, right where I'm circling as it goes around. I don't believe I have any yeah I do I do got control over it hang on a second here I will lift it up bigger so you can see this but do you see these whiffs going against the tide of everything else I mean it's like I don't know what the how to explain that never seen anything like it I don't see it anywhere else on the screen where things are actually going against a flow like that, like streaks. I don't know if it's chemtrailing of some type or something in the. And this is under the uh, moisture. This is the cloud vapor uh, animation on cod.edu uh, homepage climate. It's the it's a climate page. It's put out by DuPage College of DuPage, and it's uh, very interesting. I heard uh, oh uh, Dutch Sense say something earlier. I'm gonna point that out too while I'm here. Might as well point out Dutch Sense's uh, thing. Well, you see this right here is supposed to be the North Pole. This is supposed to cover it up. It seems that we are having a uh, pole shift right here. It seems to be going off this way towards Siberia. It stayed predicted it was going 40 miles, what, a day or something? I mean, it was just something unusual. It was moving after the earthquakes. And each earthquake said that it moved 4 inches. Okay, why don't we just change that to 4 degrees? Now, that would almost fit this pattern of being an 8 degree shift in the polar cap, or where the polar pole is, magnetic pole. Let's think about that for a minute and see how that sinks in. And that's why this is off from where it should be over here. And it's now over here towards Siberia. Interesting. Like I said, I just wanted to point out those two anomalies. This one down here where these things are streaking up going against the flow of it all and like diving into it and the pole shift which we are currently under I guess for 2012 until next time this is Spellbinder saying be good be good at it and I just wanted to bring this to your attention good day